get outside. Enjoy it today. Here's a live look at Marshalltown to start off your morning. And this is uh, you can always see the thin clouds that are in place and that's going to filter out the sunshine throughout the morning. Not going to lead any rain chances, but you see that shade of gray on the screen. That is the blowover cloud cover from the storms off to the west. They're not going to be moving into our area today, but there is going to be some chances in the next couple of days. The temperatures throughout the morning stay in the 50s and 60s all the way till around 8 o'clock and then we'll be back into the 70s later morning going into the afternoon and we'll be staying in the 70s yet again today. So the 70s still going to have the lower dew points, so very comfortable again outside, but those dew points are going to be climbing as we get into Saturday and Sunday and that's when that humidity is going to hit. But as far as around 10 o'clock later this evening, if you have any evening plans, you're going to be just fine. Watch that heat dome that's off to the south and southwest creep its way into the Midwest, mainly as we get into Saturday. That'll allow for a little more cloud cover, a little bit more of that humidity as well, but really digging into Iowa as we get into Sunday and you're going to feel it as we get into later in the day on Sunday, but we'll be underneath that thermal ridge as is off to the west. It's been at bay, but it's not going to for much longer. So let's talk about what's going to happen. As far as the sky cover throughout the day, we're still comfortable. You don't have to worry about the heat and humidity today, but off to the west, a little more of that cloud cover. I'm not going to see any type of rain chances come from the clouds throughout the day. Just going to filter out the sunshine. Then for tonight, we'll be looking at more of the clouds move back in throughout Friday. It is going to be a mostly cloudy day Friday. Some isolated showers will also be possible, mainly late morning, going into the afternoon, drying out, calming down for the evening and overnight. And then as we get into Saturday, even more chances for some showers and thunderstorms will be possible. Mainly isolated, not a really defined system moving on through, mainly just going to be some upper level impulses making their way through. But as far as after Saturday, talking about Sunday in the afternoon, we're talking about triple digit heat about 100 to 105 will be possible as we get into the afternoon, the hottest parts of the day. Again, that's the heat index. And then we're also gonna be looking at the heat hanging out throughout Monday as well. More of the sunshine, but that is going to warm things up. So two hot days back to back Sunday going to Monday. But then after that, we are gonna have some systems roll on through and that's gonna bring some cooler temperatures, especially by the end of next week.